Hello everybody, welcome to the first of several Red Exhibition matches. Uh, I'm checking the audio, just to see if it's good. Anyway, um, it's gonna, I'm going to be doing a few Exhibition matches just to show you what kind of matches can be played in Red. I did a gameplay preview for 1.0, but uh, this is a little bit different. These are going to be dedicated videos, and uh, I wish I could do them a Combat Comms style, but... I guess I'm just gonna have to be- I, I'll, I'll be here with you, okay? It's not gonna be, like, dead silence. I'm just gonna be here, you know, talking to you. I mean, I guess I could just, you know, you know, whatever. So it's gonna be a simul match. I like to call this one Masters versus Students, uh, as you can see. Um, we are going to be choosing the Shredder, and we are gonna be choosing... Gotetsu. He has the raging demons. He invent. He was. He provided the raging demon. That's why he's evil. Thank you, Spyware. Thank you, anti-Spyware. I mean. Anyway. And we are making them face off against Karai and Street Fighter Three Akuma. And I believe we are going to go to... Wait, which stage would work well? I think the Mizuki stage, but I also like the, um, the Coomer stage. Hmm. Or the Sagat stage. I'm gonna go to the Sagat stage. There you go. Shush! Go to get claimed for the song, but whatever. Alright, wow, Akuma again. Akuma again that first hit. Alright, wow. This is actually not as one sided as I thought it was. Wow, Shredder Shredder and Gotetsu are putting the work on top of Karai. What what the what was that attack that Karai just did? I don't know. Oh my god. I I don't think I don't think two rounds are enough for this man. There you go. There you go. Just I guess I'll just do a handful of exhibition matches at a time. Oh my god! Yo! Yo! Wow! Whoa! Whoa! Shredder and Gotetsu can get those combos, man! <laughs> oh my god, yo! Wow, this battle is not as one-sided as I thought it was. I mean, I thought Karai would just be completely broken, but... I guess not. I suppose not. Wow, Shredder's taunting! Shredder is fucking taunting! Wow, there's a foot soldier just running through there. Oh wow, Gotetsu and Akuma are just getting obliterated right now. That's why you don't wanna... They're beating up on a dead body! What, do they just forget about Karai? There you go. Oh! Karai is not out yet. There, now she's out. <laughs> Dude, that was really- that was pretty close, actually. I win. I win. <laughs> Back to the fishbowl, turtle. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Shredder just thinks everybody's a Ninja Turtle at this point. I think he's that crazy. Should we go two out of three? Mm, I don't know. Pretty much it blew my cover. You blew my cover! I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Uh, I don't know. Oh, it's another simul match, I think. Shit. <laughs> there you go. You know, should we, have, should we have Mr. Bear? Should we have the animal match? Let's have the animal match. We'll definitely have Mr. Bear. Oh, 
Oh, uh, ma na nature versus machine. There you go, nature versus machine. There you go, Mr. Bear and Gorilla Grodd versus Cyborg and Doctor Doom. Well, he's more magic than technology. Yeah, he's more magic to me for some for some odd reason. And still, he fits the comic book theme. There you go. I'll go with Doctor Doom because it seems pretty cool. There you go, Mr. Bear and Gorilla Grodd. There you go. And I don't care about the stage at this point. Dude, this is actually this actually seems like a dope matchup. What the fuck? What? Um, excuse me. I am your master. Okay. Okay, is it just me or is are are these animals completely fucking busted? It, yeah, no, okay. See, this is what I expected the last match. Jesus fuck. Okay. Oh. Okay, hold on, let me go back. I'm gonna go to single. I wanna see if Apocalypse can just beat up on some symbiotes. You know, let's see if- I wanna see Apocalypse beat up on some symbiotes. That's what I wanna see. There you go. Yeah, Carnage right there. Where's Venom? Where is Venom? Oh, there's Venom. Okay. There's Venom. Oh, we got Scream. She's pretty weird. And then we got Varnage. After all that. There. I could've gone to Apocalypse this stage, but eh. Wow, this works too well, actually. Your life is mine. Your life is mine. Okay, this is extremely loud. Yeah. You fool. Then again, that's just the problem with this song. I don't know why it's so loud. There you go. We are better. We are Venom! There you go. Wow, Venom is actually getting some clean damage. Not clean enough, though. Wow. A Venom just got beat down. Okay, all right. We got Scream, which she's a pretty weird symbiote. I didn't even know she existed. She's moving around, but she's not doing anything. Oh, wow. Random, random supers out of nowhere. But they don't do very much damage. Um, okay, Apocalypse is broken. She has no clue how to fight Apocalypse. I think they created a second Apocalypse. Yeah, there's a second Apocalypse in the background. Okay, Scream just died. <laughs> Alright, now we have Varnage.
Wow, he did that much on chip? Jesus Christ. There we go. There you go. Apocalypse just wanted to pound on some symbiotes. That sounded bad. That sounded really bad. There you go. Let's we'll have a decathlon right here. There you go. I mean, how long have we been going? Oh, pardon me. Okay, ten minutes. Alright, there you go. Alright, I think we can do one more. I think we can do one more. Oh, uh, which is gonna be a 4v4 battle. Um, I wanna do a Capcom versus SNK decathlon right here of just the absolute bloodiest. So I think of all the bisons, I think CBS2 bison is the most insane. So, I'll go with him. Um... And Saget? I don't know if I want to have... Oh, dude, let's have SF1 Saget, because he's just a fucking nightmare to deal with. It doesn't appear so, but he definitely is. Um... Dimitri? Should I have this Dimitri or the other one? Eh, this Dimitri is a Capcom Sprite Dimitri. We'll take it. Oh yeah, and then an Akuma. Which Akuma do we want? ST? Or do we want Alpha? I want I wanna have ST. And then for SNK, we'll we'll start light. Start light meaning meaning what? I don't know. Hmm. I mean, pretty much does that mean a Rochi automatically? I guess it's supposed it's, it automatically means a Rochi, right? There you go. Alright. Sad face. There you go. Um, then I want to throw Regal in there somewhere. I kind of want to use 2002, actually. Yeah, I want to use 2002 because, you know, he's just a busted ass piece of shit. I could have used Chelnov as a robot, but, eh. Or Metallo or Ultron. Dude, Metallo and Ultron actually sound like a really cool team. I want to do that. But then who would Metallo and Ultron face? Like, Capcom and SNK machines versus Marvel and D with Marvel and DC machines? Dude, that actually sounds like a really cool matchup. Alright. There you go. I guess we'll just do Street Fighter for most of it, and then an oddball character. So... Nah, I'm not that jerkish. That's technically not SNK, so... You know. Can't lump him in, unfortunately. Uh... Let's go with Kagami. Let's go with Kagami. Yo, let's go with Kagami. You know, I wanna do Kagami. And then, of course, because he always loves to sneak into a video... We gotta do Ignis. We gotta do fucking Ignis. There you go. Let's see. There you go. So this is a 4v4 turn match. I mean, it's amazing you. There you go. Wow, Dimitri's like... Wow, Bison is just... Bison is no chills. I know it's technically cheating to have Capcom or Zesic Bison, but... Eh. Mm. And of course, we get the Mortal Kombat stage. Yeah. I mean, it's the uncensored version. I mean, I guess I could have stuck, um, Kentaro here if I really felt like it. Oh, screen nuke! Wow, I did a lot of damage. Ah, she did a lot of damage. There you go. There you go. Oh, this is actually really close. Lose by chip out? Wow, barely did not lose by chip out. 
dude, that was actually really close. Yeah, Bison lost my chip out. Shima Shine. There you go. Alright, I bet Sagan is gonna take it. What the actual fuck? Zagat is pure bullshit in this game. It's pure bullshit. <laughs> there you go. All right, there's a Mega Rugal. Yeah, this AI for Rugal is probably not really good. I don't think I made the right call there. But I don't think any of my Rugal AIs are particularly very good. So there you go. That's my fault right there. Hopefully Kagami can clean up shop. There you go, Kagami and Ignis are gonna have to pick up the slack. Okay, he's power. Alright, power and speed are for last play. Wow, that's actually really close for Kagami. Dude, put that thing away! There are like children here! <laughs> there you go, alright. Kagami's actually trying to put up a decent fight. There you go. Yeah, I think this is probably gonna be the video where it's like, I need to update like 10,000 AIs to be better. <laughs> the discount tiger rain is just. Discount tiger rain is just bopping everybody. And then you're gone. Fuck you. Alright, so this is gonna be an Ignis. <laughs> yeah, Ignis is gonna body everybody. I know that's gonna happen. Oh wait a minute, I realize this AI is actually not as broken as I think it is. I just know Ignis is broken as fuck. Not that it not that my AI is bro broken as fuck. Yeah, wow, that's insane. Okay. There you go. You've got a lot to learn before you beat me. Try again, kiddo. Alright, let's do a simul match right here. Um, so a Capcom machine. I kind of want to just do Cyber Akuma because it's a machine. I mean, it works, doesn't it? I mean, yeah, he's robotic. Eh, screw it, I'll go Cyber Akuma. And then, for an SNK machine, what do we got? What do we have here? Oh, actually, you know what? No, 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 no. Hold on. On further retrospect, I know who to do. We have Zero Akuma, who is 100% robot, and we've never seen one of these videos before. So there we go. I could have used him for the alternate path, but more people know Cyber Akuma. Okay. Or I was just gonna be looking at the characters and then just stumble upon the right thing by accident. Be like, hey, this works. <laughs> there you go. Look at, red. Look at this red earth shit right here. Okay. I love how I have pretty much every enemy in red earth. There you go, I have Brainiac. Why do I have Brainiac? I don't know. There you go. Yeah, SNK really just prefers people to be there villains, not really anything else. Oh, I'll find a way. I'll, I'll find a way. Oh, well, there's Phobos if I really wanted to for Capcom. You know, of all the matches, I'm really just still shocked about that first one. Cause I thought it was just gonna be a clean sweep in um Karai and Akuma's favor, but I suppose not. Maybe if I would have chosen a stronger Akuma, then they probably would have beat it, but you know, whatever. Shit dude, I'm at a loss.
I mean, Thold Orb is a killer instinct. Oh, actually, I could use Sentinel as the Marvel Machine. Yo. Sentinel and... Oh, I wanted to use Ultron. Sentinel and Metallo? Yeah, but Sentinel is more like a grunt than anything else. Okay, yeah, the fucking... Deep. The most gigantic grunt you've ever seen in your life. There you go. Technically, Platonic Twins is a machine, actually. Yeah, let's go with Platonic Twins. There you go, Platonic Twins. There you go, found it. There you go. Yeah, sorry, Sentinel, but just... Yeah, dude, Ultron and Metallo just sound so much cooler. There you go. And we'll go to, uh... Where is the... There you go. This, the Omega Rugal stage. There you go. Hey, Dad. Alright, there are two people that turn into a machine. Now I'm gonna make a difference if I would have chosen Cyber to get another cool speed. Dude, Cyber matches are a whole lot more interesting than I ever gave them credit for. Metallo turned into Apocalypse. Oh my god, dude. Seriously? There you go. Uh, I guess I can just upload this right away and just see, um, what you guys, what your guys' ideas are. Shoot me exhibition match ideas and I'll do them. And then, at that point, and then send me better AIs if at all possible. And then I will, uh, make them happen. Yet again, that felt underwhelming. I spent so much time deciding. Oh, you know, there is only one path to peace. Your extinction. Dude. Savage. Maybe I should go the natural route on this guy. Dude, maybe... Oh my god, maybe... Um. Okay, Gorilla Grodd is still DC. So, maybe we could have a natural man. I kind of want to save Vulture for Marvel, but... Uh, I want it to be like all animals. Hold on. Yes, it's true. I don't know this roster all the way. You know. Sorry. Yeah, that's the only one that really will work in this situation is Vulture. Because... I guess DC has balls? Golden Threads, huh? I'm at a loss. I truly am at a loss. I mean, I guess if you want to count the symbiotes as animals, I mean, they have spider properties, but, I mean, we already used them, so fuck. Um. Do you want me to throw in Mewtwo? M Mew Mewtwo? I could have a Mewtwo. I could have him barf a John if I felt like it. Eh, screw it. I, I'm not I'm not gonna get any closer if I'm just bitching. I mean, Vulture was in the teaser and he did pretty good, so let's see him do that. And then we'll use Gorilla Grodd again. Yeah, I'm gonna have to reuse Gorilla Grodd, but whatever. And then we'll have Ultron and Metallo. And let's go to stage 100, just, just to cap it off. to beat me. Round one, fight. There you go. Wow. Is most of this just Gorilla Grodd's doing? Is Gorilla Grodd more broken than I anticipated he was? Yeah, dude, never underestimate the animal. They can, they can screw you, dude. Round two, 
Probably a whole lot closer. Never mind, no, it isn't. It could Gorilla Grodd take me a fucking day. No, oh my god, yo! Yo! Okay, Vulture's down. Dude, wow, this match is. Okay. Well then. Having these tasty ass Guilty Gear jams, dude. Tasty ass jams. Dude, guilty. I don't. I don't care what anybody says. Guilty Gear's music is just godlike. All all the games have such good music. Well, I mean, main series, obviously. All right, so Vulture's dead again. Yeah, but I thought. But I think most of the pressure was getting put on by Gorilla Grodd early. Vulture did easy stuff, but it's like Gorilla Grodd is just. It's, it's insane. <laughs> I mean, he's basically a gorilla that acts like a man. So then there's a man who acts like a bird. Okay, Meta dude. Ult Ultron pulled through. Ultron pulled through. I think I know what can kill him. I think I know it can kill him. I think I can know it. I think I know it can kill him. You know it can kill these two? Now nah, we already used it. <laughs> there you go. An emperor and a god. Let's do it. There you go. Let's push it to thirty. Let's push this shit to thirty. I shall die for what I feel. All that exists. Round one. Fight. There you go. Alright, Shao Kahn is just getting beat up. Legit Oni is actually putting in the finest. But it wasn't good enough, I suppose. I'm not stopping until Ultron and Metallo fall. I'm not stopping until Ultron and Metallo fall. Something's gotta beat these two. No, that's not like general shit. Yeah, Shao Kahn just got beat up right now. Yeah, only have to play it so safe. And I don't think it's in Oni's nature to play it safe. Why does Metallo turn into Apocalypse? Why? Oh, I'm going to show you the end of the world. Boom! Okay. Uh, have your way. Let's bring in the Eternal Champion. Don't worry. And the Dark Eternal Champion. Let's do it. I'm probably just gonna name down to Dark Champion. That's what I'm gonna do. Round one, fight. They brought this fate upon themselves. Maybe we can confirm who's harder, the Eternal Champion or the Dark Champion.
I mean, I guess the Dark Champion is more unknown, but then again, the Eternal Champion is also pretty unknown. I mean, can you really judge? There you go. Yeah, I think the Champions are going to be putting in most of the work here. Dude, wow, he just busted through no super with that. Yeah, I don't know how to do the form change and stuff with Eternal Champion. Damn. And then I don't know what EC is doing. He's just floating there. And then and then the Dark Champion is just flying around doing his own thing. Like, half the time, they he just takes himself off-screen. Alright, Metallo's gone. Can Ultron pull it back like before? No. They didn't even get one KO. Not one singular KO. There you go. So anyway, those are some matches. Uh, hope you had fun watching those. If you have any suggestions, leave them down in the comments below. And, you know, we're just a few moments away from Red 2.0 being dropped. So, there you go. Anyway, I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.